Hey, what's going on YouTube? Welcome back to another brand new video and in this video I'm going to be sharing with you guys a free Windows optimizing tool that will help you to gain extra FPS, improve your gaming and overall performance of your Windows with a few clicks. I hope this video helps you out so make sure to stick around till the end to find out the best settings and with all that said, let's get started. Alright, this technique will work on both Windows 10 and 11, so follow this step. Open up settings on your PC, and once you're here, go down to gaming, open up game bar and turn this thing off. Game bar turned off will give you better performance as it consumes a lot of CPU usage. Go back to gaming, open up game mode and turn this thing on. Game mode turned on will optimize your PC by turning things off in the background, giving you better performance and a headroom for your PC for performing better. Right beneath that, you'll find graphic settings. Simply open this thing up, click on change default graphic settings and enable optimizations for windowed games. This will help you to reuse your latency by using advanced features. And after that, go back to graphics and you'll find a list of all of the games installed on your PC. You have to select the games and then click on option and then select high performance right over here so you can use your GPU for entering the games. Once that is done, simply close your settings. Step number two is the local group policy editor and this is only available for Windows Pro users. So if you have a Windows Pro, simply Windows and R key together and then open up gpedit.msc. Once you are over here, extend your screen a little bit until you can see everything clearly. Select administrative templates, Windows components, app privacy and you'll find let windows apps run in the background over here you can simply set this thing enable and then default for all applications set this thing to force deny this will help you to reduce your applications running in the background and, and it will help you to set a strict policy on your PC. Once that is done, click on OK and then close local group policy editor. Next step is the best power plan and for that, open up control panel on your PC and then search for power options right over here. Once you're over here, select high performance as it will as it will enhance the energy consumption of your PC and utilize your hardware performance. Next step is creating a restore point and I highly recommend you guys not to skip this one. Search for create a restore point on your PC, select your local disk C, click on configure and make sure that turn on system protection is enabled. Then click on create and then name it something that you can remember. This will help you to restore all of the settings and your data just in case you want to revert everything back to normal without any data loss. Once that is done, simply click on close and close system properties. Last step is the Windows Optimizer tool. You can download this for free from the link in the description below and you'll find in four simple folders over here. First one is a CPU optimization in which you'll find AMD and Intel folders. If you have an Intel CPU, you can double click and run the Intel CPU priority. And if you have an AMD CPU, you can double click and run the AMD CPU priority. After that, you'll find RAM optimization in which I have left a ton of presets. I have 16 GB RAM, so I need to double click and run the 16 GB RAM registry. Could be different for you, so you can pick one from this list and once again if you don't like it you can always reset it back to default right over here third folder is a registry optimization and i highly recommend you guys to run each of these to gain extra fps it helps you to disable all unwanted services background applications maps transparency and so much more on your pc so you can simply double click and run all of them and if you want to revert them you can always go to this folder and revert all of them last is the free tool that is the optimizer 16.6 you can double click and open this thing up now once you're here in the general settings simply enable optimize performance menu delay optimizer network disable all of these right over here for disk drive disable super fetch and search indexing for applications disable the first three options that is office telemetry firefox telemetry and chrome telemetry then for privacy disable telemetry tasks and home tweaks then move over to Windows 11. It could be Windows 10 if you have a Windows 10 on your PC. Then over here, you have to disable My People, Long Path, Sensory Service, and Cast to Device. Then for Windows Update, disable Insider Service and Driver from Updates. For Privacy, disable all of them. And for Gaming, enable all of them. For Touch, disable Windows Ink and Cloud Clipboard. And for Extras, you can disable Copilot AI and see if that helps you to gain extra FPS. And if not, you can always enable it back. Next, move to the Cleaner section right over here and you'll find a list right over here. Select all of these files right away and then the cache files from all of your browsers. And once that is done, simply click on Analyze and it will show you the data that can be freed on your PC. Now I keep on cleaning this regularly so it is really low but it could be above 1 or 2 GB for your PC. So you can simply click on the clean button and it will one clean optimize your PC. 
Next, go over to the network section and then over here, you can go and select Cloudflare and then click on set DNS. If Cloudflare is giving you any issues, you can select Google and then set DNS right over here. And then also click on the flush DNS cache and it will get rid of all of your ping, packet loss, latency issues on your PC. Next, go over to the option settings over here and then click on update on launch. So if there are any updates available to optimizer, it will automatically update that. And I'll also keep on bringing new guides for optimizer as soon as they get the new updates. Once that is done, you can click on restart button right over here if that shows up on your pc because a restart is really necessary i'm already using these settings so it is already done and once that is done close this and and you are now using the optimal settings for gaming and performance on your pc i hope this guide helps you out if it does make sure to leave a like and smash the subscribe button we are really close to 200 000 subscribers also if you're not a channel member yet consider getting the channel membership because it encourages me to make more awesome contents like this we'll see you guys in another amazing video until then stay tuned keep watching bear fox and peace out